Now let's understand the third inventory management technique which is FSN analysis which is also referred as fast moving, slow moving and non moving items. Now this analysis helps businesses to identify items with different consumption rates. So the logic used in FSN analysis is the consumption rates and they can take appropriate actions to optimize their supply chain operations. Now what are these FSN categories let's understand. So F means fast moving items. So these items are actually in a high demand items and they also have the faster consumption rate and they are frequently sold or used in a businesses and they have higher turnover rate, higher inventory turnover rate. And that's why fast moving items require close monitoring and efficient replenishment strategies and also sufficient stock levels to meet customer demands without having any stock outs. On other side, slow moving items, these items are relatively having slower consumption rate compared to the app category of items and they may have moderate demand or occasional demand uh, from the sales team and these items need frequent evaluation and they may require special attention to prevent excess inventory or holding cost or even obsolescence of the products. Then third category is non moving items. So these items have very low or even negligible consumption. These items have minimal or no sales or even no usage over a defined period of the time. And that's why non moving items are basically a risk uh, in terms of overstocking or you know tying up our cash capital in the storage of these non moving items. And that's why businesses need to actively manage these non moving items to reduce the cost and to prevent obsolete inventory in the future. If we take simple example, uh, if you go for a car servicing and in a service store, uh, there are multiple automotive parts and in that parts, if you consider fast moving parts, so you may see fast moving items like commonly replaced filters or engine oil or you can even see spark plugs that have a frequent demand in the market. In terms of slow moving items, you will see that you know high end car accessories can be part of slow moving items or if you have specific model of the car and uh, for that car there are accessories which can be part of slow moving items and uh, because of that they have moderate demand and that's why they have a less frequent sales. In terms of non moving, you will see the products which are rare or very obsolete uh, in nature. Usually the car parts uh, for such cars which are actually discontinued 